Most of you know I used to be aroused about an area, but I did. You saved me here a while back and I turned my life over to the Lord. And <laughs> I do have a new radio show going on in Tumble now on WKRIST. <laughs> it hadn't took off just quite like we hoped it would, but the Lord works in mysterious ways. <laughs> so I'm only too glad to get him back over here to band here in county now and then. You know, to do a christening or a wedding or on a sad day like today to do a funeral service. I'm only too glad to just go where the Lord sings I and mean, try to do what He tells me to do best I can. I know some of you fellas probably have a hard time believing it's even me standing up here in a suit and tie and everything after all that stuff we went through. But we are here today to on the service and I'd like to thank all five of you fellas for showing up. Mine Bell was not an easy person to know or love and she has gone home now and so we're here to try and do the best service we can for old Mine Bell. So let's get right down to it here, fellas. I am about as dead in Jesus. We just want to thank thee today that that has seen fit to bring her home. Amen. I am about as dead. There's no doubt about this time she went over in the kitchen with a thud and scattered her to a surprise for a little Popeye slobber and kick her dog in his Amen. Here to carry on, I'm about dead and gone left to see her carry on, I'm about dead and gone left to see her carry her big fat annoying ass out to the graveyard and bury her knee so she won't get up even in the bad dreams to holler her and say shit at us. Amen. I'm about dead. She killed her husband, poor old Pete, I guess we all know that. She screamed him to death, hollered him to death, but little him to death. <laughs> Tore him down, stomped on what was left in him. Poor old Pete, he wasn't a bad guy, he just found himself a dream. Big old rock. Oh, so I've seen times when she'd get on to the point where he'd slap his own face and start talking in tongues and several tables. I understand that's what he was doing that one day when he died. He quit back there just to win class. I'm about as dead. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for bringing her home to thy bosom. I've been seeing hard and left even for thee. You just might want to watch yourself a little bit safer when she gets in his arm. <laughs> I'm well, gonna be a big, uh, big sale on Tuesday. We understand big sale on Tuesday. Tell your friends to tell your relatives, tell your enemies. One of the girls on about that big sale on Tuesday. Who will? Who will buy her angry purse? Who will buy her crack bowling balls, fly speck glasses? Who will buy that pink thing? Who will buy her little dog? Who will buy 30, 40 boxes? Wet readers that exists. <laughs> Half a car to eat my thoughts, cigarettes, and enough yeah. chicken pot pies to get you from there to your turn. <laughs> we'll buy a sidewalk made out of storm doors and cardboard. <laughs> that old Pontiac full of saplings and sparrows. I'm the best dead, I'm the best dead. But I think that about a dozen fellas, if we can just get her up here now and get her over to the hole there and get her in. <laughs> if we can do that, I think we can go into shorties. He's probably still open. Hell, if he's not, he'll open up when we get to him. You know he will. <laughs> just there in that little trailer and all. The Lord helps him and helps himself, and I think we can all get a little help after we get through with this fella. Let's all just get on one corner here and get her up, and once we get going, now, don't stop. Just keep her moving. We'll get right over there above the hole and let her go. 
Not you, Jimmy. I know about your back, man. You just kind of just go around the corner here and get her up and get her moving and get her in. And we'll hit the tent. Get her done. Okay, I'm going to count to three. When I say three, just lift and move as quick as we can. We all have to plan to get her over in here. And goodbye, honey. Two. 